Hello there. This is Jonathan Clark from Lose Weight for Scotland. It's my mission to crush obesity, add years to your life, and help you look good naked. Now I challenge Scots to either lose 10 pounds of fat or gain 10 pounds of muscle, even if they've tried everything else and it's guaranteed. Now one of the questions I get asked all the time is, what's the best fitness equipment to buy for my home to lose weight fast? Now, my wife and I bought a treadmill and we do use it for interval training, bursts are running to burn fat. But it is big and it takes up a lot of room. Lots of folk buy one and it turns into an expensive clothes horse with a 12 month warranty. But I quite like to watch TV on my iPad while I'm running on the treadmill. Apart from that, I have some free weights and an exercise ball. So forget about the ab cradles and anything that vibrates, shocks or whatever other crappy gimmick QVC tries to flog you. But wait, if you order in the next hour, we'll add this incredibly useless rehashed recipe book and copper bracelet that has no health benefits whatsoever. Trust me, my wife has tried all the gimmicks and I often just shake my head when I see the wires and the pads coming out. Despite what infomercials and glossy magazines tell you, there's no particular piece of equipment that will help you lose fat better than another. Losing fat is a result of expending more calories than you consume. It's not what type of equipment you use. So no matter what you read, hear or imagine, and forget what the infomercials tell you, quick weight loss usually isn't permanent because our bodies just don't burn fat very fast. What you typically see if you get a dramatic drop in the scales is usually from water loss. Okay, here comes the science part, all right? Theoretically, to lose one pound of fat, a person must have a calorie deficit of three and a half thousand calories, meaning you have to eat three and a half thousand fewer calories than you need, or burn three and a half thousand more calories than you eat, or find a combination in between. So to lose 10 pounds, a person has to generate a 35,000 calorie deficit. This is most women need approximately 2,000 calories a day to meet their total energy needs. This could take ages. Women who try to lose weight still need to consume at least 1,200 calories a day, minimum. Any less can have unhealthy effects on your body. To be honest, instead of focusing on quick weight loss, it's a good idea to focus on ways to keep healthy and active in order to reach your long-term fitness and weight management goals. You may also want to look at why you want to lose 10 pounds in the first place. Is your weight keeping you from doing other activities? Or is it that you just think you look gross when you see yourself in the mirror? That's what got me into action, that disgusting belly fat, jelly belly, that slowly grew on me. Now, with regards to time, if getting to the gym regularly proves difficult, or you just don't want to go because you're embarrassed, or it's too expensive, there's other ways to keep fit. You don't need to invest large amounts of money in fitness equipment that ends up buried in the kids' playroom. Try investing in a set of these. Okay, let's go old school. Skipping ropes, put on some great music and skip to the beat. With a skipping rope, you can switch between skipping rope sets and strength builders, such as sit-ups, push-ups, and other free weight exercises or body weight exercises. Incorporating more activity that really doesn't take any extra time. What I call net activities, no extra time. So for instance, climb the stairs instead of using a lift or escalator every chance you get. I actually make a point of running up the stairs in our house. I rarely walk up them. Going for an early morning walk or a jog or a run first thing if you're likely to get bogged down and work later on the day. Download websites or mobile apps that feature workout videos on demand. Then you can just do one right here. At the time of shooting this video, the two I like are Gym Boss and Chronometer. The whole trick is to build in calorie burning exercise that's convenient, takes less than an hour, and it gets tougher with time. If you enjoy it, you'll do it more often. That way your body will lose fat, build muscle, and tone up in a way that you actually enjoy. Imagine that. So there you have it. Now if you enjoyed the information in this video, and you'd like to receive 20 more free videos on the top questions that people ask most about losing weight, building lean muscle, and getting fit, and a copy of the nine psychological terrorists that hold you hostage in your own body, all you need to do is go to www.loseweightforscotland.com. Just type in your details and I'll get them straight to you. Thanks for watching. Take care. See you later.